huge sparks going everywhere. Oh, across big the sparks! Again. It's sounding a little bit, uh, yeah. sounding a little bit funky. The uh, the Tilton Interiors car, so it's, it doesn't sound 100. percent Garth's still pushing here, so here we go. He is on the flying lap. pushing through there though, but the thing sounded a bit funny down the main straight. I think got some more downforce screwed into this car for this run, but here we go into turn number six, Garth Walden on Jeez, the money, a little bit business. of push there, he's going to use oh, right out on the edge of the track there, the oh. exit of the new pit lane, he's definitely pushing hard, can he do it? He's already in front obviously, but can he better that time and nail it down? Can we see one of the quicker guys or other guys go quicker? Here as he comes up over Corporate Hill now, tips into the left hand, uh, and uh, no speed showing at the moment, but that's about 160 k's around there. How much more downforce is in that front wing? Yeah, it's got a bit on it. What, Noahs? We've seen him very clean through the whole lap in and drivers have got all the pressure on him here. Coming up through now the last section, Garth Walden, the reigning champion, sits in the number one position. He's got a target on his back from the rest of the team. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen, through the final turn. And here comes Garth Walden in the tip now, Tilton Interiors. Well, Evo, down the line, ladies and gentlemen, can he better that time? He's in the 24s already. Go. Waiting for it here. It comes Garth Walden. 24 8 4. He's gone quicker. 24 8 4. Garth Walden, still the quickest, but an improvement. Edge to a clear cheer, cheer, clap, and whistle, please. That is an amazing five minutes of fury. You had to wait all weekend to see it. Uh, God bless the diehards that stayed around to see. Hundreds of a second between Suzuki and Walden. How good is that? That is absolutely amazing. crazy at the end. Uh, we, we lost power coming to the main straight to finish the lap. We just, I don't know, something went wrong with the engine, I think, and just had no grunt. So, uh, to just get it like that, it's full credit to all my boys. I've been working so hard all weekend and nothing but little problems, and uh, we just got it out just to make the shit out. So, those, if without those boys, we wouldn't be here. And to our sponsor, Royal Purple Oils and uh, Tilton Interiors, thank you guys. And you know, now that you've won, you know, this car's won the event twice in a row, you know, you're tying all kinds of records. And you know, I, I think that the, the program is strong. And you know, you had an amazing finish with uh, under Suzuki coming right behind it. Did you expect that to happen? No, uh, full credit to those guys. Wow, that's a, that's a fast two rear wheel drive car, I tell you. And to, uh, you know, just get it four hundredths of a second, I was told on the radio. That's a bit too close for me. Yeah, no, definitely. So now we're, we're into the 24 second range. And I think for the future, you think one day we'll see 23s, low 24s? Yeah, I think without a doubt, I think the car behind me is quite capable of it. We just didn't get a chance this weekend to pull it off, so we'll have to come back next year, right? Oh, they're going to pop it. Shall we pop it now? Let's pop that champagne, the podium. Let's go. Let's pop it all out. Are we ready? Do you want to have a speech, Ian, or no? After it, after the champagne drowns everybody. Here we go. All right. 